the most common four day split is the upper lower body program that we will go over now. As the name suggests, you divide the body into an upper and the lower body section and structure your workout accordingly. Your upper body workouts will target mainly your chest, back, shoulders and arms, whereas your lower body workout target your quads, hamstring, glutes and the calves. App exercises can be added to any of the two, but they are usually done in the lower body workouts. The weekly schedule usually looks like this. On Monday, you do your first upper body workout. On Tuesday, you will do your first lower body workout. On Wednesday, you rest. On Thursday, you do your second upper body workout. On Friday, you do your second lower body workout. And then on the weekend, you rest again. This allows for a frequency where each muscle group is trained once every third or fourth day, which is right within the ideal frequency range for most people that passed the beginner stage. Of course, you can also switch around these days. Just make sure you get enough rest in between the workouts and don't overtrain yourself. So which exercises should you do for each of the workouts? The following is a sample workout that is built accordingly to the principles of the right exercise sections, exercise order, volume and rest times. In your upper body workout one, you start with bench pressing for three sets of six to eight reps. Then you do incline pressing, again, three sets of six to eight reps. And then you do cable rows for three sets of 8 to 10 reps. This is followed up with lat pull downs of 3 sets of 8 to 10 reps and then you do 2 sets of bicep curls for 10 to 12 reps and 2 sets of lateral raises for 10 to 12 reps. Optionally, you can also add 2 sets of triceps pushdowns. For your first lower body workout, you start with deadlifts three sets of six to eight reps, then leg pressing again, three sets, but in the 10 to 12 rep range. Then you do leg curls, two sets of 10 to 12 reps, and then calf rises, two sets of 10 to 12 reps. You finish everything off with two sets of an app exercise of your choice for 10 to 12 reps. In the second upper body workout, you start with weighted pull-ups, or if you can't do weight to pull-ups, normal pull-ups. Here do three sets of six to eight reps. Then you do the T-bar row, three sets of six to eight reps. Then you do the barber shoulder press, three sets of six to eight reps. This is followed by the dumbbell bench press, three sets of eight to 10 reps, and one-handed tricep pushdowns, two sets of 10 to 12 reps. Optionally, you can also add barbell curls with two sets of 10 to 12 reps. And the second lower body workout starts with squatting, three sets of six to eight reps, and then weighted lunges, three sets of 10 to 12 reps. This is followed by leg extensions, two sets of 10 to 12 reps, and calf raises, two sets of 10 to 12 reps. Again, you finish this off with an app exercise of your choice for two sets of 10 to 12 reps. Now let me finish this video with a few side notes. Generally, all barbell exercises can be done with dumbbells and vice versa. Barbells allow you to lift slightly more weight and I personally prefer them, but it's up to you. Lat pull downs and pull ups can be interchanged and you can also try different grips. Just make sure to find a good rhythm and don't mix it up every workout. Cable rows and T-bar rows can also be interchanged. The motion is similar and only the width of the grip and the height of the pulling is different. The exercise order by importance, that means 
more strength and muscle gains will be made with the first few exercises in each workout. So if you are pressed for time or running late and want to cut your workout short, make sure to cut out exercises towards the end, not the beginning. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit the subscribe button before you go. If you have any questions, comment below, give me a like and just follow me to don't miss one of my videos on YouTube, Instagram and Facebook. To your success, your health and wealth mentor.